Hi, Jamie Klimke here with Brian Ellington with Keller Williams. Brian, tell us a little bit about your new coaching program. It's been a huge success. Yeah, we just rolled this out in the fall. It's called Bold, which is a business objective, life by design. And uh, the main crux of the program is that um, when you have education without accountability, it's just entertainment. And so what we started doing is asking the coaches from the MAPS division here at Keller Williams to go into the local market centers to help hold agents accountable to achieving the goals that they've said they want to achieve. And the program is a seven-week program. Now, the initial test pilot of it was so successful that we've been kind of inundated with uh, requested to keep the program going. So the results were, um, it's a seven-week program. We had about 580 some odd agents in the program. They did about 5,500 transactions. Now, some perspective on that. In the industry, up until recently, the industry average was about 12 transactions per year. Nowadays, we're looking more like six to 10, depending upon the agent. But that's in a year. In this program, the results we've been seeing thus far have been in seven weeks, an average of about nine to 10 transactions per agent. The focus of it really is about um, keeping your marketing going. As we've always said, it's a prospecting and a marketing industry as far as lead generation is concerned. And you never want to pick one lead generation method over another. You always want to have a well-rounded lead generation profile. So keep your marketing going, but add to it your prospecting, your door-to-door knocking, your cold calling, your sphere of influence calling. Um, a huge part of the program is calling up 100 people per week in your sphere of influence and asking who do you know who needs to buy or sell real estate? Adding to that, of course, is the follow-up marketing and, and putting those clients on the drip campaigns that you've always meant to do. Um, the difference here is that you've got a coach to hold you accountable. And I think the results kind of speak for themselves. That's great. Yeah, it's an awesome program. So, is that been the main focus of the show here at your booth? Well, that too is a big part of it, but uh, we've also recently uh, revised the ship book. Actually, we've added a new board and we're releasing a hardcover edition. Now, that's actually coming out this spring at our family reunion, which is our major convention in uh, New Orleans this year. Um, the hardcover is a limited edition, the new board by Gary Keller. It's uh, a nice little hardback, beautiful edition in black, Gary's favorite color. Um, so that'll be released this spring. And the other thing, of course, is for us, education is is paramount. So our big anniversary uh, um, show is our family reunion. It's what we call our annual convention. Uh, we're uh, we're going to be in New Orleans, Louisiana this year. We're expecting about 6,000 to 7,000 of our closest friends to show up. Uh, it's about a five-day long conference filled with training um, from everything from how to build your business to how to maintain your business to how to deal with the issues that your business generates. That's great. What, what would you say are the top three things or top three tips you might give to an agent in regard to their marketing practices? Well, first of all, it would be focus on the market at the moment. And within that, you've really got three distinct markets. Um, that would be short sale, foreclosures, and then first-time buyers. And the, the biggest opportunity that most agents uh, can capitalize on right now, especially in regards to the foreclosures, is the buy side. Now, foreclosures have a, a limited amount of agents who are going to be able to overcome the, the hurdles, the financial hurdles and otherwise, that it takes to get into that sort of business on the list side. However, on the buy side, understanding how the procedures work, understanding from the listing agent's perspective how the transaction will occur, will help them to, to better work with their buyer clients in order to purchase distressed properties. Um, short sales, of course, are a huge factor and will continue to be, and we expect that to be a, a significant part of most agents' business next year. So making sure that you understand um, not just the overall transaction process of short sales, but also the individual institutions. They all have different practices and procedures, and you have to understand each one in Individual. There's some great training programs that we offer agents through Keller Williams University and through MAPS Coaching as well that will help with that. And then, of course, first-time buyers. And, and we have a great book called Your First Home that Gary Keller and Jay Papazan wrote to help agents. Um, it's really kind of a pocketbook that agents can give to prospective first-time buyers. Nobody throws a book away. And so when those uh, prospective buyers are ready to buy, that's sitting on their shelf, or they can give it on to a friend of theirs who's looking to buy it. For them. But there's also a first-time buyer. Uh, seminar that the agents can put on in their areas to attract those first-time buyers to answer the sorts of questions that they're all going to have. And we've got a ton of material to help support that that the agents can use so that they don't have to recreate a seminar it's in a box. That's great. So a lot of great education, a lot of good information. Thank you very much for your time. My pleasure. Thank you for having me. All right.